everyone, today I am going to tell the story of Samuel. So there lived a small boy named Samuel with a priest called Eli. One night while Samuel was sleeping, he heard a voice saying, Samuel. Then Samuel rushed to Eli and said, Here I am. And Eli said, I didn't call you. Go lay back to bed. And then when Samuel heard the voice the second time, Samuel. And then Samuel rushed to Eli and said, Here I am. And after that, Eli said, I didn't call you. Go back to bed. The third time when Samuel heard the voice, Samuel. Then he rushed to Eli and said, Here I am. Eli said, I didn't call you. Go lay back to bed. But if you hear the voice again, say, Speak, Lord. Your servant is listening. So when Samuel, finally, when Samuel heard the voice the fourth time, he said, Speak, Lord, your servant is listening. So Samuel was talking to God the whole night. And so when Samuel grew up, he became a prophet. And all the Israelites wanted Samuel to choose a king. So after that, Samuel was confused. So he asked God, God, is this the plan for me? Then God said, I will send you a man tomorrow who is strong and tall. He will rule over my people. So the next day, a strong and tall man named Saul was anointed by Samuel and he was crowned king and ruled over the Israelites people. After a few years, Saul became really selfish. So, all the Israelites wanted another king. Among them, there was a small shepherd boy named David and he was anointed king. What I learned from this story is, man looked at Samuel's outward appearance, but God looked at his heart. You can talk to God, I can talk to God, even though if we're not a priest or a prophet or a king. We can, we can hear God's voice and talk to him. But when after some, after some years, when after some time, there was a small boy named Jesus who was telling everybody how to obey God's words. Thank you.